But okay, here we are. Yeah. Unfortunately, the red eyed dragon still recognizes a uh, Zig. So, Dart is without a dragoon spirit in this fight. The good news is, however, that uh, Dart is wearing the red is wearing the red dragon armor. So, all damage done to Dart with uh, magic attacks will be uh, nullified. They will not do any damage whatsoever. So, okay, here we go, the fight against Zig. Like I said, he's pretty much just going to be a uh, darts knockoff. So yeah, we're fenced. We're pretty much fighting dart right now. If you want to just put it that way. Here's a flame shot. And he uses it on darts. Okay. Good start. So yeah, everybody else can transform into a dragoon but uh, darts, so there are no specials. This is the detonating arrow. So let's just uh, go and go all out. Now, the fact that we are uh, dispirited really doesn't matter. Also, I suppose if you want to say this is kind of like darts test. Oh, here's a uh, final burst, I believe. Yep. As if the flaming wings wasn't a dead giveaway. Yeah. What are you complaining about, Dart? He's doing no damage to you. Okay, this actually might hurt. Yep. That actually kind of hurt. Doesn't help that I'm not at full HP right now. There we go. But yeah, there really isn't much to say about this fight, other than this is going to hurt a lot. Well, except for Dart and Kongol, because, well, their uh, magic defense is quite high. But yeah, this is just pretty much a clone fight in the game. Just like how the other battles with the other Dragoons were... Uh, pretty much just fights against yourself. Um, this is... This is the same thing. Except for you're fighting, uh... Dart's counterparts. Instead. It's interesting that the only, uh, Dragoon that you never fight is, uh... The White Silver Dragoon. You never fought Shirley in this game. I mean, she quizzed us and she made it seem like a little bit of a battle, but 
if you don't fight her, she just asks you questions the entire time. So you really can't call that a fight. But yeah, this uh, LP is pretty much near its end. We just had to fight Zig here and uh, stop Shauna from becoming the uh, God of Destruction. You can even see Sean in the background there, uh, just like curled up in a ball, or, well, in a fetal position. Zig's sword looks like it would be painful though, because it's like one of those swords that has a prong at the end of it. Or... Well, it, it's like a lance if the lance had the uh, prong on the opposite side of it, and uh, somebody stabbed it into you to pull it out, it would like pull out your organs with it. Yeah, flame shot on uh, Miranda. But yeah, I really like those kind of lances, the ones that have like the uh, the tip. It has like the tip, and then they have like a. Uh, ends of it like pointing out in various different directions so when they stab it into you and pull it out it's pretty much it would like instantly kill you you would not survive what unlike if it was like a normal lance and somebody used it on you it would just hurt like hell might kill you depending on where they put it, but it wouldn't instantly kill you. Okay, so... We have a chance to recover our uh, characters at the end of this fight before the next one. Yeah, unfortunately, we had to kill the God of Destruction. Because, of course, while this fight is happening, uh, Shauna's continuing her transformation. Her rebirth as the God of Destruction. Yeah, it doesn't really matter what kind of attack that, uh... Congo is hit with because, well, he... He's a wall. I seriously turned Congo into a wall. That can sc survive anything. Okay, we're almost done with this. Uh, 
Okay, it's over. We finally beat Zig. And those two are going to go at it. What do you, what? And derp. Surprise, surprise. This was not Zig the entire time. It was Melbu from uh, the leader of the Winglies. As who our true opponent has been this entire game. Obviously not, since he was kind of living inside of Zig. Kinda creepy. Okay, so since uh, Rose attacked Neat, um, Zig, of course, transformed into a Dragoon, where Claire also went to go and join in. <coughs> Thus, a battle between uh, Malbu, who was uh, Zig, and Rose ultimately ended up killing... Uh, Claire, because, well, her martial arts are nothing compared to what was going on between those two. And so, since, uh, Malbu took over Zig's body, he just pretty much left. That's why nobody was there when darts went down there. But, uh... He is going to go and do us the pleasure of taking Shauna out of the God of Destruction. And become the God of Destruction himself. So yeah, we have no problem of killing this guy now. Because that was our only hesitation about trying to kill the God of Destruction. Was that if we went to go and stop the God of Destruction, we might have had to uh, kill Shauna with it. Oh hey, it's Lloyd. Lloyd's alive! Okay, so now we get to watch a little, uh, battle cutscene. Which is actually pretty interesting. We don't really see this that often. So we have both Dart and, uh, Lloyd.
Okay, so there goes uh, Lloyd. See, it wasn't that battle quick. Yay, no gold and no experience points. Awesome. See, that is... That is probably one of the most hilarious things that they... Really do in this game. Oh, what is this? Yep. Let's go and kill the final obstacle in our way of confronting the fate of Soa. We must save the world. With that, we acquired the Divine Dragoon Spirits and the Dragon Buster. So, I'm sure you're thinking, oh, that is so awesome, we get to use the Dragon Buster Sword. And all of its awesome, flashy goodness. But, no, we don't. We don't at all. Um... See, what happens is, oh, because of the game's, uh, how the game makes the, uh, weapons and stuff. And how they're holding your hands, how they look all exactly the same. Rose's weapon in the battle will look exactly like it's always been, even though she's using the Dragon Buster. Ugh. What was that sound I made? Yeesh. But yeah, the uh, Dragon Buster will not look like how it looked when it was in Lloyd's hands. It will look like all the upper other weapons we've been using with uh, Rose. So yeah, it's, it's a really good weapon. Don't get me wrong. But I wish they would have made... It have its own, uh, look. I wish it would look exactly like it did all the other times we saw it. But it doesn't. That's rather disappointing. But either way, uh, that's the end of this episode. So next time on Legend Dragoon... We'll be taking on the final battle of the game against the God of Destruction. I will see you all then. Bye.